please forgive my unquestionably suspicious appearance. The truth is, I am the son of a provincial lord. Lord! Hmm? Rose. That's right. My husband here is nobility. What? You're married? Never had I lifted anything heavier than a fork in my life. Yet by chance did I fall in love with a traveling merchant. In the throes of passion, I threw my money and land away to be with her just over a year ago. You... you did? Even my wife didn't know the full truth. The cruelties of the outside world taught me how feeble I truly am. But even so, I knew a husband has a duty to protect his wife. So I wear an ornamental sword at my side as a hollow pretense of strength. Laugh at the weak will of a sad, broken man. Ah! Sorry. You're doing your best. It's cool. Oh, my dearest. Your sweet words are succor to my tired limbs. Sow the seeds of love and they will bloom no matter how arid the terrain. Live and be strong. Next! I don't know how that worked, but I think we made it. Thanks, guys. More like we just lucked into the perfect audience. A win's a win. Turns out it's handy to have an invisible woman on your side, isn't it? I suppose. I'm sorry I told you to be quiet. So it's all right if we communicate directly inside your... No. It's creepy and obscene. Obscene? I'm not obscene! Come on. Let it go, Lila. All right, then. I assume that we're on our way to Pendrago now? Well, uh... But, Miklio, this town looks all kinds of exciting. Well, it does, so... We really ought to poke around at least a little. Did I nail it? Guilty as charged. Sounds fun. I'm game. Bunch of children. That's why we get along so well. And someday we all will. You mean seraphim and humans?
my. Don't those potatoes look scrumptious? Oh, yeah. Radish bells. They're on the smallish side, but they're super sweet and delicious. They look like they'd go great with butter. That, or you can just bake them and sprinkle with salt. Oh, my gosh. That sounds delicious. You know those have got poison in them, right? Poison? Oh, yeah, something like that. Eat enough, and it'll be your last meal. Well, sheesh, you just gotta cook it thoroughly, right? Nope. That actually strengthens the poison. You're even deader now. How about if you cut the eyes off? Does that fix it? Whoops, still dead. Radish bells contain poison in both the eyes and the skin. Now you remove all the skin and slice out the eyes. It's perfectly safe. Hey, Lila, where do you think you're going? I'm afraid this conversation is a bit... <sighs> I think she has some concerns about your food safety standards. Get out of town! What do you mean they're selling elixir? It's true. Word around town is that the nobles in Highland and Rollins can't get enough of the stuff. But how are they getting access to it? I thought the church controlled the entire supply. Well, they say they've got the church's blessing. <laughs> no pun intended. And apparently the damn stuff actually works. Longer life, fresher breath, everything. Well, don't that beat all? What beats all is the price of that junk. You gotta be one rich chump, let me tell you. <sighs> yeah, I should have guessed as much. The church is selling elixir now? Something sounds off about that. Wilkis Wilk. Hey, Saray, what does my true name mean? Oh, it means Rose is Rose. Rose is Rose? Isn't that kind of lazy? Is it? I mean, I made it on a whim, but I thought it seemed fitting. It was an urgent situation, after all. Hmm. But Princess Alicia used to be a squire, right? What was her true name? Melphis Amekia. It means Alicia the Smiling. I see. So it's not lazy. You're just being biased. Huh? How? My smile is pretty gorgeous too, you know. Quit it, Rose. You're scaring me. Rose, that's just how Saray is. Yeah, I know. Maybe his name should mean Saray is Saray. Is there any sort of rhyme or reason to what happens when you fuse equipment? Great question, Rose. You're right. There's nothing random in the fusion of equipment. 
Can you just tell it to me short and simple before I fall asleep? Sure. First, the rules for fusing two different equipment skills only apply to those located in the same slot. So it actually does matter which slot each skill is positioned at. Yes. What skill is placed in which slot is a very important factor in equipment fusion. So it's important to... <sighs> well, it's... Huh? Are you asleep? Is this Belfry all machine run? Yep, it's what Luston Bell is famous for. The gears get moving, the bells get swinging, and it sounds like the most entrancing music. Now that's something I'd like to hear. Wow, you'll only get something like this in the city of artisans. Such craftsmanship. Oh, an art appreciator now, are you? I wonder how the motor works. Don't ask me. I hear the sound of the draw works. They're probably utilizing the power of the aqueduct running underground. Aqueduct? Really? Nothing I can see suggests that. That's because it's a hidden refuge area. This place was built as a fort in the first place. Oh, so that's why this place is surrounded by castle walls. Before it was a fancy belfry, this was a communication tower for sending smoke signals. So much history everywhere. This is too cool. Guys seriously geek out over the weirdest things. <laughs> well, let them have their fun. Yeah, I suppose. But goodness, we usually reserve such sensitive matters for later hours. My apologies, Your Grace. I merely wish to offer my gratitude for the services. It is appreciated. But you must understand, Cardinal Fortin and the other high clergy have very strict requirements for us. I am aware, Your Grace. Be assured that my organization will be most generous in our contributions. It looks like that is the town sanctuary. Shall we? Fethmus Vioma, those Ralph Roulet, Hefson Euland, Lucan Yerland? Hmm. You okay? Are you not feeling well? Bethmus Mioma, Luzroth Roulet, Hefson Euland, Lukeheim Yerlin. Bethmus Mioma, Luzroth Roulet, Hefson Euland, Lukeheim Yerlin! Whoa, what are you doing? You tell me. When I formed the pact with Lila, she told me I had to remember those in like three seconds. And now I can't get them out of my head. <laughs> it was an emergency. I couldn't help it. Lila can be pretty forceful sometimes. I wish she were a ghost. She'd be less scary. Weren't you going to check out the sanctuary? 